What's going on guys? So welcome to Unbox Monday. So this Unbox Monday is based on the AMT 125th scale uh, Coca-Cola short hauler. So go on the box, what's on the box, and open it up to so, see so what comes inside and take a more detail right on. Alright, so first up, there is a lot of parts in this kit, guys. So be prepared, be prepared when you want to build it. But you got tear, you got clear tinted red and amber lights, and of course the clear curve parts. Very nice. Alright, so I couldn't figure out these two if I can mirror together. But this one just has your wheels and your tanks. You see back there. Shiny chrome and more bits and pods over here. Very nice chrome by MT. Okay, so in here is your big chrome tree, which has more wheels, your your grill, bumper, and all kinds of parts, engine parts, mirrors, exhaust, your tanks, your half super tanks, which I don't. Not a big fan of that, but that will do. I might have to strip it because <laughs> the glue depends what kind of glue you use. You have to use super glue, and it could fog it, and it's just never good. So, but the chrome looks amazing. Now, right, so here is the body, and the body is very nice, very nicely molded. Not much flash, I, I seen it when you took a look at it, but hardly any flash. A little, little tank clean up here and there, but nothing too major. There's the actual cab and your hood, obviously. Nice big Ford emblem right there, so you can paint that any car you wish. But injector pad marks down there, or bubbles down there, but not a big deal. But the body is very nice. I'm actually pleased about it. Alright, so next bag has some seats and shocks, or beast springs, I should say, and license plate buckets or holders. Look at the detail on that. That is just some very good detail. I just can't get over that. Even on both sides. Look at that. Beautiful. Then, this one has your main interior bucket. If your door panel is moving in there, but with some detail, but I think, yeah, very shallow. More shock parts or flame parts. And <laughs> your steering wheel and your dash. And these are your flame parts and your axles. And this before I showed you guys, the dry chef broke off this tree. Don't want to miss that. All right, so next bag is the this tree has like almost all your engine parts. Nice diesel engine. Like I guess that guys hardly any flash, barely any cleanup, and it's just detail of galore. It's amazing. This tree's a little weird, but <laughs> and oh, those wheel chucks. 
Oh, cool guys, you get wood chucks in there. That's pretty neat. And more engine parts and chassis parts. Exhaust is your exhaust and your firewall. Truth weird. Wheelbacks and your rear. Pretty darn cool. Alright, oh, so now we're moving into the big trees. So this is your frame. I uh, love AMT how you do this. You know, a two part frame. You know, you have to put it all together. Just make your building a real thing. I know it's a little bit harder of some people, but um, but what the heck. It's just like your building a real, real thing. Then the rest of the parts are for your back box, whatever you want to call it. Looks like it's your, your elevator type deal on the back there. And there's your one side of your box. A lot of injured their marks, but that doesn't matter because you won't be seeing any of those, to be honest. So, that's pretty cool. Alright, so your biggest tree, or biggest bag, I should say, in, in the kit is here. And, yeah, you got a CB radio. <laughs> but, yeah, like I said, this is mostly your box parts. I guess it's the back end or front end. I guess I can show what that is. You got some wood green, which is awesome. And some various other added parts. There's that tree. There's this one. More box parts. Like these trees are just all your box parts. Get some good high quality glue for this, guys. Because this is going to need it. You know, those mud flaps. Kind of long. Huh. And your main box parts. It looks like it has a side door, which is actually pretty pretty neat. But here your wood green and that's your roof by looks. Yeah, it says right there. And your side. And pretty darn cool. Okay, so first up, before I forget, you did get one metal axle for your back axle, I'm assuming. And you get your amazing tires. Your six tires, and <laughs> that's how they mold it, which is actually pretty cool. You just pour your mold down there. A lot better than having a seam down the middle, but these are Goodyear. I'm gonna assume, yeah, Goodyear. But I love AMT tires, especially for the big rigs, because they tell the tire pressure. Actually, you guys can kick that right out, but there is, like, like you know what air pressure should be in the tires. And that goes for all of them. Drip pattern's pretty darn decent. Actually, it's actually pretty good, I should say. And they're kind of soft, which is pretty neat. But like I said, you gotta cut that right out. That's your molding process right there. Okay, so last up in the kit is your decals. And I think most of you guys have been waiting for this. And I have too. So, I'm the truth. Oh my gosh. Look at this, guys. Come on, camera focus. Look at that. Enjoy Coca-Cola. Various different license plates. You can get Coca-Cola license plates. Guys, this is... Pretty darn cool. Now, Coca Cola, you can order themes, uh, was obviously red, but there is a choice. You can paint this truck yellow, but I don't even think yellow's gonna look good on this truck, to be honest. But look at that Coca Cola license plates, various different license plates, you got more down there. Guys, this decal sheet is huge. Here's your caution decal for the back, I believe, and your, uh, what well, you guys don't, um, what well, those are, those are number, numbers for like when you, on a, when you're on a highway, and when there's a truck stop, you have to have your, like, uh, number code or something, to order to go past, like a DOT number code they call it, or something like that, up here they call them DOT numbers. So, guys, this is a pretty cool decal sheet. Your 
Americas. Pretty darn cool. So after taking a very good look at good look at this kit, can't talk today. <laughs> I really do recommend this kit. I um I can't just say anymore, but this is a this is a beautiful kit by round two guys. I really do recommend it. I think it's a good deal. Uh, I'll put the link down below where you can get yours. And like I said, if you're a Coca Cola fan or a Coca Cola maniac like I am. <laughs> There's no better truck than this. You, like this, you need a short hauler, cold cola truck. So guys, thanks for watching this Unbox Monday. And I know a lot of you guys have been requesting me to do this Unbox Monday on this truck. So here it is. And hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button. And uh, until then, talk to you guys very soon. Bye for now.